Alright, welcome to my first uh, episode of my Minecraft Let's Play here. I'm just going to be playing Minecraft, you know, casually, not going to play with any objectives in mind, just kind of build stuff. I've already picked out a little island here where I'm going to build my starter home. I, I haven't progressed very far, all I have is like two iron tools, a bunch of random blocks. But uh, yeah, right now I'm just clearing out all the trees from this island here, so I can probably build like a big sort of farmhouse mansion here. Because I'm eventually going to like tear all these trees down, turn it all into like farmland for like all the builds I'm going to build around here. So I've looked around this area and there's a lot of cool spots to build like castles and towns and stuff. But for now I'm just going to build myself a little house that I'll live in live in temporarily. Yeah, let's take care of these trees first. So I just have some room to build. There's actually quite a few biomes around here. There's like most of this is dark oak, and then there's a jungle that way. And there's one of those new uh, cherry blossom biomes past the mountains there, too. And then past that is like an ice spikes biome. So that's like a lot of different biomes in a close by area, which is what I really wanted. Because I want to build a whole bunch of like different towns that have like different aesthetics. It's like maybe like a, 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 t a town that's like a whole bunch of pink blocks. And a town that's a whole bunch of like black blocks, like different colors, based on each town, and they're all going to be close by. At least that's the long-term goal, anyway. Right now, I'm just worrying about building this. It'll start raining. <laughs> Hopefully, the rain isn't too loud. I haven't tested the rain audio levels yet. I was actually I was going to try out the ray tracing on PC. But I was surprised to find out they don't have ray tracing on the Java edition in Minecraft yet. I know it was in like beta not too long ago. But I, know, I didn't see any options for it. And I did some research and I couldn't find anywhere to enable it. Which I thought was surprising. I thought they had like already implemented it. Before this, I played on uh, Bedrock on console, and there's so many things on Java that are so much nicer, like having, like being able to hold torches in the offhand and like place them. Oh, whoops! Place them like that. That's so awesome. And so many other things you can do with your offhand that you can't do it in Bedrock Edition. This is so much nicer. Uh, if you're wondering why I have so much bread on me, it's because before I found this spot, I went through a couple villages that had like a whole bunch of hay bales. They broke down into wheat, and those give you a lot of wheat. So I was pretty good on food for a while. See, up there on that hill is probably where I'm going to build like my end game, like big castle where I live eventually. I haven't decided yet. I know it's gonna be like I want to have like big black walls, so I don't know if I'm gonna use like the deep slate stuff or like that blackstone stuff that's in the Nether. Though for the Nether stuff, I have to actually get to the Nether first and mine a lot of it because I want the whole hill up there to be like the whole castle. Definitely gonna have plenty of dark oak wood after this. Oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, definitely gonna be using, using that for a while. Maybe not to build with, but 
to, like just to make random wooden things things out of. Oh, that was my last iron axe. <laughs> and the last of my iron. Oh, I have to use stone axes for now. I need to go on a cave, a cave adventure sooner rather than later. Just to get a whole bunch of materials. Just so I have good, good weapons and tools and stuff for a while. Since what, most of the time I'm going to be building these big projects. And just having, you know, a whole bunch of iron axes and iron pickaxes and stuff to mine blocks just will make everything go by much faster. Yeah, it looks like the first of our wheat has grown. Oh, never mind. I thought it was fully grown. I was wrong. <laughs> Oh, this is going to be the last of our cobblestone, too. I might have to go on a, this cave adventure sooner rather than later. Like, once this axe, bra axe breaks, I'll probably go find a cave somewhere to explore in. And we'll have a little mining adventure for a little bit. This area that I'm building around now is probably going to end up being the uh, green district. So I'm going to make it look as green as possible, like put leaves everywhere. And all the crops are going to have, like, they already have like green roots. So there's just going to be a lot of green around here eventually. Build of all kinds of green blocks and stuff I can find. Well, of course the last tree is one of those infamous big oak trees. They're a pain to cut down. Hopefully, this axe lasts through it. Uh oh, it might not. <laughs> yeah, no, I didn't think so. <laughs> Alright, big oak tree, you win for now. But I'll come back. Yeah, it's literally the last tree, and then this whole island is clear for me to build. Which in order to make this the, the green area of green, I don't think there's any good looking like green building blocks. I might just have to build like oak wooden houses and then like cover it in like moss and leaves and stuff to make it look as green as possible. It's probably my plan. I got, I got one cobblestone to my name. <laughs> yeah, definitely time for a little cave adventure. Torches of all the coal I have. See, I got iron pants and some leather boots. <laughs> Let's bring a bunch of wood for me just in case. Perfect. Um, yeah, I think that's we're good for now. I got plenty of food. Let's sleep and then I think there's a cave right underneath this island actually. No, I don't know if it's going to be like one of those completely underwater caves. Because if it is, we're going to have to go somewhere else. Hmm. Yeah, it looks like we're going to have to go somewhere else. Quickly. <laughs> oh. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm playing on normal difficulty because uh, hard is too hard. Mostly because I know the well, literally only because poisonous spiders kill you with their poison. Otherwise, on normal, it just takes you down to half a heart. It looks like we're going to have to find a cave somewhere around here. Oh, here we go. I already, I already found one. Oh, there's a 
bunch of spiders in there though. Oh yeah, I forgot this isn't bedrock. I can actually, I have to like, I have to actually time my swings. I can't just spam the attack button. Oof. Oh, I hear a spider coming. Look at this weird room. Hmm. Oh, I hear more mobs. Some copper, which I will not mine yet, because it is not used for much right now. But iron and coal, though, I will take plenty of. Once I make, like, a strip mine, I'll probably make, like, a whole mining area. And I guess that'll probably be the the gray district with all the gray buildings and blocks. Uh, only one iron, really. I mean, I'll take it. <laughs> Eventually, I'll need a way to get up onto cobblestone, which isn't just mining inside of caves like this. Oh yeah, might as well make a crafting table before I forget. This pickaxe is about to break here soon. Yep. Oh yeah, might as well make another axe while I'm here. And a shovel. Let's get the whole tool set here ready. That's a dead end. If I remember, I think there's a hole somewhere around here that went deeper. That's where all those mob sounds are coming from. There's like grass down there too. Let's try like mining like a staircase down from here. There we go. Oh wow, it's like a whole underground like ecosystem down here. Oh wow. <laughs> oh no, there's multiple of them. <laughs> Let's not die already. Oops. Let's let them come to me. There we go. There we go. Yep. Okay, maybe it's better to have food in this offhand than the torch is going to keep accidentally placing them. Right, let's cover up this lava before I get punched into it. Ow, or just walk, walk into it. <laughs> there we go. Oh, please don't kill me. I cannot believe that killed me. <laughs> yeah, okay, Java distance is a little bit harder than Bedrock, apparently. I Wow, I cannot believe I died from that. I literally put like my pinky toe into the lava. At least this cave was like right next to our island there. Alright, there we go. Everything's back in order. Alright. Uh, mental note. Be very careful. <laughs> Once I get back home, I'm definitely going to make a sealed ASAP. Because sealed are super good at keeping me alive. Can't believe that lava killed me. I thought it, on normal, it only docked you down to half a heart. 
Hopefully poison doesn't kill me either, because that would suck. Might as well play on hard if everything... If nothing, like, stops at half a heart. I think eventually I am going to switch it to hard mode after we get, like, better set up here. I'm not fighting for my life every cave I enter. Oh, that's like a big ravine thing there. Let's just sneak up the side here. Ow. Oh, is this going back out back outside? Oh, it is. Wow, nice. Yeah, these are all like surface caves, so we need to go back down deeper. Oh, there's some coal I missed here. Ooh. Yeah, I'll go there after I explore this direction. Oh, nope, I can get up here. Ow. Alright, come back into the little hole here. Oh, really? Oh, no, there's a baby zombie. <laughs> oh, my God. Where are all these zombies coming from? Oh, my God. Oh, my sword broke. Are you kidding me? Stop my axe. Jeez. I swear to game that used to be this difficult. <laughs> oh, I see they came in through here. Let's explore over here first before we go super deep. Yeah, it'd be really cool if I found a spawner somewhere down here. Because that would mean it'll be a spawner like right next to our whole base of operations there. Make a farm out of it later. Hey, look at that, I already got a second coal. Oh, is that my first piece of andesite? Oh. Yeah, I'm actually, I'm actually gonna turn around back to the, the deeper section, because that looks like a pain to explore. And there's a skeleton sniper waiting for me. Yeah, this looks like it goes way deeper than that other side of the cave. Oh wow, this opened up to like a huge hole in the ground here. Oh, that's crazy. I right, think there's this conveniently placed waterfall where we can slowly descend whoa way deep down there oh wow oh my god this place is crazy I have to be very careful zombie like right next to me somewhere. I don't know where he went, but... Wait, is that diamonds? Hey, look at that! <laughs> Found diamonds and one of these uh, geode things, I think they're called. Like if we mine into here, there's gonna be like crystals and stuff. Oh yeah. If 
phenomenal. Hopefully it's more than just one diamond, but it looks like it's, it's just one. Woohoo! This is deep plate stuff I might use to build the castle out of at some point. Let's see. Oh, there's that zombie from a minute ago. Oh, he's getting swept downstream. Here, let's just go ahead and go as deep as we can go in this place. Oh boy. Lots of bad guys down here, though. This is like the worst place to fight a skeleton. Uh -huh, and I saw more. I thought I saw some more diamonds over here. Oh, and a hole. I think all these diamonds are like embedded into the clay, so it's like hard to find more than one at a time. Hey, I'll take it. We already found two so far. Oh, I'll make it three. Now I can already make a diamond pickaxe. Might just explore this level for a while, because we're at... What, why negative 32? <laughs> so I might just explore here for a while. Yeah, I need to make that sealed ASAP, because these skeletons are going to be... Annoying to fight down here. I literally watched this guy spawn. I think that's iron up there. Oh no, it's gold. I need some iron. I only have one piece of iron through this whole adventure. Oh, there's a lot of mobs over there. It's like prime area for diamonds, though. Let's fight them one at a time. I can kill him in three hits if I just like time my jump attacks well. Alright, let's not die to the lava again. Oh, that zombie already sees me. Okay, you know, he, he's getting swept downstream. Oh, there's two of them, isn't there? Yep. Uh oh. Oh. Are they fighting each other? Oh. <laughs> and a zombie one. Wow. Chains, how like ores spawns work. But no, iron was gonna be like this rare. Oh, hey, apparently, I just have to complain about it and it'll show up. Ooh. Hello, Enderman. Oh, hey, I almost missed those diamonds, they were hiding from me. Oh, come on, really.
Awesome. Six diamonds already. I think I just need a lot more iron. Too close there. If I picked a fight with an enderman, I would definitely lose right now. Considering how I get bullied by skeletons and zombies. Hey, more iron. You love to see it. It's like in the ceiling there. Or I can build like a spiral staircase that goes up there. Looks like another cave entrance as well anyway. Sounds like just a skeleton. That's gonna be in my way here soon. Alright, where are you at? There you are. Fight me. Alright, diamonds are now mine. Oh, things are getting a little tight in this cave now. They all seem to be leading to the end, so. <gasps> Oof. Oops, okay, got a little too close there. Oh my god. Okay, I need to be more careful. That's me since I am starting to get a little lost. back soon. I might have to do a little bit more research because I think maybe iron only is in like mountains now. I'm not sure exactly what the spawn rates are anymore for all the ores. It's been a minute. Alright, yeah, I'll start heading back in the direction of home here. I might take one of these flowers with me because they, these are the flowers that turn rate like the green particles that are flying around. That would be nice to have around the house. Alright, I'm not gonna fight a whole zombie army here. Let's go ahead and head back up. I'm gonna pray that there's no skeletons waiting to snipe me off of here. That fish almost pushed me off. Alright, here we go. Back to the surface at last. Yeah, I think iron only shows up at like certain elevations. Definitely not that deep as much. But I'd say it's still extremely successful. We got freaking some moss, diamonds, lots of coal. Definitely a worthwhile venture. Alright, home sweet home. <laughs> the one safe spot in this whole area. I think we already need another chest. All the different stuff we got. Oh, whoops. Actually, I think it needs to be a little higher. There we go. Now we get the little green particles everywhere. Right, and finally, just finish chopping this tree down. Okay, 
I guess I can also make a bow and arrow now if I wanted. Yeah, plenty of arrows. It looks like some of our crops have grown too. Oh yeah. Yeah, I got these potatoes from one of the villages I went to before. But what I want is carrots. Because carrots are not to cook and they still give you an okay amount of hunger. But for now we got plenty of bread to keep us alive for a little bit. 